guys welcome back and if you're new welcome thank you for stopping by to check out my video today so today as you can see I decided to do a bright pink look on my eyes and I said you know what let me go ahead and turn this into a full-on pink face so I have my pink lips going along to match my pink eyes okay now I really like this look I do I like how it turned out I don't always like pink on my eyes I'm not really that big on pink that's why I didn't buy the ColourPop what is it the whichever one is the pink palette I didn't buy that one because I know I have pinks already <laughs> I already have purple so that whole explanation is kind of ridiculous because I didn't need any of the palettes I bought <laughs> ColourPop but I didn't buy the pink because I'm not that much in love with pink but anyway enough of the ya 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 this is the look that I decided to do today and the reason why I wanted to go ahead and create a look today is because I was super duper excited about my ColourPop pressed eyeshadows that I received I don't know why I get so excited about being able to choose my own colors and basically create my own palette because that's what you can do with these pressed eyeshadows now they just really started pumping these over the last month or so I believe because they've been having sales and stuff and I caught the first sale I was super excited because I was able to create a palette of eyeshadows with the first sale and when I got it of course I was like dang I need some more I want some more so they went off sale and of course I was like nah I'm not paying full price for these because during the sale you can get 24 pressed shadows of your choice along with the magnetic eyeshadow palette for $44 so it's a really good deal it's like what less than two dollars per shadow plus you get the holder to go along with it so what I did when the sale came back as soon as I saw it come back I was like oh I'm about to order me another one so <laughs> I did so now I actually have two palettes that I created from the ColourPop pressed shadows now of course I'm not going to swatch every single one of these eyeshadows in this video now the way I separated my shadows out is this one is all shimmer type shadows shimmers satins and things of that sort and this one is all mattes. unfortunately I did purchase the same shadows I think twice I think I have two of these that are, that are duplicates but you know no biggie but these are the mattes and these are the shimmers so that's how I decided to separate my palettes because I couldn't figure out where I wanted to put what so this is what my palettes look like aren't they gorgeous you guys they are beautiful I love them <laughs> So I'm really excited to just kind of test out all the shadows, create different looks, and have fun with these individual pressed shadows. Now, if you're not aware of how the magnetic palettes work, all of these can be removed and switched around and all that good stuff. So that's really cool about these palettes. Now with this eye look that I created today, I did go ahead and use all pink shadows and shimmers and things like that so in the tutorial for this video I will just go ahead and list the name of those shadows I am going to do a separate video you guys swatching all of these shadows so just in case you're interested in purchasing some of these shadows when the sale does come back or if you don't mind paying full price which I would not advise <laughs> but if you do want to get some of these during the next sale, I am going to have a swatch party swatching all of these shadows just so that you can know what the ones that I bought look like swatched. Now with this look that I created today, I really like how the shadows performed. I feel like they were pigmented, they blended out nicely. This one here is super duper pigmented. I used that in my crease and it's really really pigmented and very very bright so I really really love that shadow and you know what let me go ahead and pop this out so I could tell you what the name of this is okay so the name of this bright pink here is sandbar just in case you're curious that is extremely extremely 
pigmented and bright and the first shimmer that I have on my lid which I really really love as well which is this and it's a really really pretty duochrome type shade and it's called Mr. Sandman so it's very very pretty I like it like it a lot so anyway so enough of that I'm going to go ahead and just show you the swatches of the shadows that I used for this look and then we'll go ahead and jump right into this tutorial So these are all the colors that I used on my eyes today. As you can see, they swatch fairly nicely, very nicely, and they're really nicely pigmented. For the price, I would say you can't beat it. So let's go ahead and jump right into this eye look. Mm -hmm. 